Nerd Reactor, roll out. What's up, Reactorites? I'm John, and it's time for another Once Upon a Time. And in the last episode, it was a very tragic one. Um, Graham, he just, he died. And I thought he was going to be a recurring character for the show, for season one. But Regina made sure that didn't happen. And she pretty much just crushed the heart. And it was like Emma was finally opening up and, uh, you know, letting her guard down, letting the wall break. But just for that moment where, you know, about to like find some kind of happiness with him, it was all over. And, uh, yeah, Regina. <clears throat> so what's going to happen with Emma after Graham's going to be gone? Uh, yeah, maybe we'll find out in this episode. So let's check it out. No, you can't have her. No. What? So you Maleficent? I mean, the queen? <laughs> so we just see how Rumpelstiltskin becomes who he is today. Hmm. Shut up was a good man. Aw. Graham! I believe that after two weeks of acting as sheriff, the job becomes yours. <gasps> You're the sheriff now. I'm just not in a hurry. So, um, thank you for the kind words. I'm like, what do I do as sheriff now? That's the thing about children. Before you know it, you lose them. Are you a good guy or a bad guy? Make up your mind. That we can use them together for Operation Cobra. Oh, yeah. You still on that? All right. Thanks. Oh, Henry, what's Come up? Come on. What's up? You've been ducking me for weeks. I think we should stop Cobra stuff for a while. That was your idea. You don't play with a curse. Look what happened to Graham. Aw. This is probably best. I don't want to upset her anymore. Aw. Henry! 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 You're the sheriff now, in these parts. Oh, I'm sorry. That's not for you. Man, you're always at the right time. You're not getting it back. Mm -mm. Actually, I just did. Miss Swan, you're fired. You can't fire me! Oh. She just fired me. Two people with a common enemy accomplish even more. Wait, who's a common enemy, huh? The queen? How would you like a benefactor? Oh. A benefactor. Do you mind? Oh. You have something against the queen? Tell me. Well, it's quite comprehensive. And the mayor's authority? Well, maybe she's not quite as powerful as she seems. Hmm. All right. Talk to me. Want to the poor? Yes. Oh, thank you. Look at that. Good guy, Rumple. In the ditch, hide. Go, go. Stop go. right there. Oh, no. What are you doing on the king's row? That jackass. Wool. I know you don't have wool. No, I'm just a guy. Spindle Shanks. Spindle Shanks? His name's Rumple Steelskin. Hush, boy. Rumple. Hey, that's my nickname for you. What's your name? I'm Balfire and I'm 13. Looks like a hobbit. Frodo Baggins, my name. It's treason to avoid service. Oh no. Kiss my boot. Oh no. In front of my boy. Kiss my boot! Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> At least he didn't take the boy away. This man has put the needs of Storybrooke above his own for as long as any of us can remember as chief editor of the Storybrooke Daily Mirror. A.K.A. Gus Fring. Hang on a second. Sheriff Gus. Uh-oh. It requires a vote. And guess what, Madam Mayor? I'm running. Fine. So is Sydney. I am. <laughs> I am. Yes. Everyone has a choice. Wait a minute. Are you... Are you Wormtongue from Lord of the Rings? Never underestimate someone who's acting for their child. <gasps> He's not her oh. child. Ruby! How was school? Okay. I can't talk to you. 
Is it a lie? No. I was born in jail. Oh. Ho, ho. I don't care what people know, but this hurts Henry. He would have learned eventually. No. <laughs> He's a snake, Miss Swan. You need to be careful you get into bed with. I'm not getting into bed with anyone. I'm just fighting fire with. Oh, whoa! <laughs> Emma, you're gonna be the hero? Huh. Hmm. Is that a trap? And what a sane person would want to get involved with that. So it's true. Hmm? What? It's true, you ran. Oh, hey, 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 hey. And mother, did she leave you like the knight said? You told me she was dead. Oh, no. Come on, Dad. Why does that matter? Because white buns. Hmm. Wood burns. Ah. You're gonna leave me, aren't you? She's gonna save you. Regina, you're still gonna hate her. <laughs> well, I think Gold did that on purpose to show that Emma is a hero. You see, Henry? We don't have to fight dirty. Oh, don't say that. What do you notice? Take a whiff. It smells like your sheep crap oil. Oh. Look at that smile. It is the dagger of a thousand truths. Oh, Sydney. Uh-oh. How is Catherine? Good. She's meeting me here later. That's wonderful. Well, I'm all out of posters. I'm gonna go get some more. Okay. Wow. Can't can't talk about Catherine in front of her. This is really just about beating Regina. Hell yeah, it is. She needs to go down. Henry. I want to show him that good can actually win. Oh. This is something I have to do on my own. Oh no. Go home, son. You're gonna turn. Go home and wait for me, babe. I'll be oh, back. Honey. You go. You're going down a path you can't follow. You're gonna turn to the dark side. Right, there he is. <gasps> yes, you do. Wield the power wisely. Oh, yes. Ooh. Now what? What have you done? Oh, he can't die. Oh shit! Looks like you made a deal you didn't understand. Magic always comes with a price, and now it's yours to pay. Uh oh. Mm -mm. Uh oh. It's turning. Sydney Glass and Emma Swan. Glass swan. Sounds like something that a decorator would make you buy. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, crickets. Okay. Crickets. But here's the thing. Uh oh. The fire was a setup. <gasps> no. Mr. Gold agreed to support me in this race, but I didn't uh -oh. know that that meant he was going to set a fire. Oh no. I'm sorry. Oh, he's not happy. Virginia, get that smile off your back. Another. Another. Hey Henry. Hey Henry. Hey. <laughs> uh oh. What? Congratulations. Huh? Sheriff Swan. What happened? The sheriff, brave enough to stand up to Mr. Gold. Hmm. Enjoy that. Oh. No. Now you're making a lot of enemies, Emma. Oh no, Frodo Baggins! Oh! Oh, he's evil. Where are you? Kiss my boot! How about a little felty? Oh yeah, kiss the boot. Kiss my boot. Not in front of the boy. Oh! Oh! Oh, I'm just trying to ride this horse. Papa? Yeah, you see? I didn't run away from the battle. 
You're safe, Bay. You're scaring me, Father. You do know I'm armed, right? What if it was? It's all part of the act, my dear. Oh, so it was all part of the plan? They had to see you defy me. And they did. No way. Ah, uh, yes. I know how to recognize a desperate soul. <gasps> Dark one. Congratulations. He's a crappy one. Well, so Emma's the new sheriff, and people believe or they like the story of how she stood up to Mr. Gold because people apparently hate Mr. Gold more than they hate Regina. And so she won the vote against uh, Mr. Glass. And uh, now things are going to be different. Regina gives Emma the badge. And to slowly, she's turning things around. So now Emma's going to be... Now that she's the sheriff, and then get Regina as the mayor, they're going to be butting heads a lot. And it's going to be creating this power play. It's going to be very, very interesting to watch just to see what's going to happen. But now Emma's going to have more power as a sheriff. And she's going to be able to like just run things her way. We'll see how that goes. But in this episode, it you get to see uh, the kind of like the origin story for Rumpelstiltskin and how he becomes evil. And pretty much, he, you know, he kills the Dark One. He gets cursed. And now he's the new Dark One. And now his son is scared of him. Uh, but before returning, you know, he was... I, I believe... The, you know, I like to think that he's a good man. He ran from war or whatever. But the way I uh, interpret that was that he wants to get back with his family, with his wife, with his son. But maybe, um, maybe it did happen that way where the wife didn't like how he was a coward. But I like to think that he just wants to be with his family and he didn't want his son to lose a father. Or maybe he wasn't born during that time. So it's, I'm not sure, I'm, I'm kind of hazy about that. But in the end, I still think he's like a good guy before he got cursed. And uh, with Henry saying that he's bad, don't trust him. So that means Henry's really set in his ways like you can't save someone. Like maybe there's a way to bring him back to his old self again. Uh, or he's a lost cause. Because Henry, uh, he's, he's still not sure, you know, what's going to happen if, you know, good is going to prevail against evil. Because evil would do some evil stuff and good always has to follow the rules. But yeah, if good's corrupted, will they ever be good again? Will there be redemption? Uh, you know, Darth Vader had redemption. And I'm hoping, I don't know, uh, maybe we'll see more of how Mr. Gold, like maybe before his past, that he's still good somewhere. And I hope that's the case because I kind of like this, uh, the storyline where, you know, oh man, look at that. Like I can kind of root for him now. Um, but... We'll see where the show goes if they ever do that. And to show that he's really good, maybe he's suffering, he's changing sides. Uh, I think that would be like a really interesting dynamic just for the show. So yeah, let me know what you thought about the episode on the comments below. also like to thank our patrons on Patreon for helping us out, uh, for helping and supporting the channel. And the patrons get you know early access to videos uh, just like this one, Once Upon a Time. We also have a Facebook group. Check that out. I'll be there. Other reactorites will be there. And yeah, I'll be sending, uh, you know, posting up just random stuff or upcoming uh, teases uh, for you know, videos. So yeah, with that said, I'm John and I'll see you guys next time.